Our proprietary Agentic platform leverages RAG-enabled multimodal LLMs with MCP function calling deliver autonomous decision-making at scale. If you're trying to make decisions about AI agents, whether to build them or buy them or even run away from them, you're probably drowning in jargon and AI newsletters and various LinkedIn posts about the agentic revolution. But at the same time, your technical teams are having completely different conversations. They're debating which technology to use. They're getting pushback on their token spend by someone in finance who doesn't even know what that expense even means. And some of them are already using agentic AI, whether your company approves of that or not. And you might be stuck in the middle, expected to make strategic decisions, allocate budgets, manage risks, and all while trying to figure out what everyone's actually talking about. And that's why this course exists. But this is not going to be a generic technology project management course with simple ROI calculators or where I tell you how to easily figure out what level you're at in the maturity model. Because agentic AI is different. This is not mature. We don't have 10 years of case studies to point to. We can't calculate predicted returns in a spreadsheet when we're still figuring out what these systems can actually do reliably. But that doesn't mean you should wait. Because if you're waiting, your teams are already building. Your competitors are experimenting. And the gap between those who understand this technology and those who don't is widening every day. So here's what we're going to do. The first module here is the foundation. You'll understand what makes something agentic and why an AI agent is fundamentally different from regular computer programming or traditional automation or even the generative AI chatbots. Now, this first content is content I've already created for a broad audience that will give you or anyone else the conceptual framework for everything that follows. But that's just the start because the rest of the course is specifically for a business leader audience. So if you're making decisions about AI projects, if you're setting direction, if you're managing teams building with AI, or even just preparing to step into those roles, we're going to cover the technical concepts you actually need here. Yes, we'll talk about orchestration, about MCP and RAG and tool use and vector databases. We'll talk about tokens and inference costs, not because you'll be coding these systems all yourself, but because you need to understand what your teams are talking about what vendors are actually selling, what's possible, and what's snake oil. We'll also talk about the organizational realities of this. How do you find out what AI adoption is actually happening in your company now? How do you evaluate vendor solutions when everybody's using the same buzzwords? How do you govern systems that make autonomous decisions? And how do you understand the impact this will have on your own employees? Now, this course won't make you an AI engineer, but it will make you dangerous in the right way, informed enough to ask the hard questions, practical enough to spot the actual opportunities that this is good at, and skeptical enough to avoid expensive mistakes. Let's begin.